The Church of Uganda's House of Bishops in a meeting held on October 4th resolved to set up a special committee to review the nomination process preceding the election of a new bishop of Namirembe Diocese. The institution of this committee followed the filing of a petition by a cross-section of the church faithfuls, citing acts of corruption, unfairness and conflict of interest as having marred the nomination process. And that was in line with uh, our canons that say if there, is, uh, there are queries in the nomination process, the House of Bishops interfaced with the nominations committee. After a month-long investigation into the nomination process, the five-member ad hoc committee is now ready to present its findings. This will be done this weekend when the House of Bishops meets in Bujiri. We, we think when uh, that report comes out and is tabled, it is going to guide the House of Bishops on the next course of action. And that can be to move on and elect from the two names that submitted or to start the nomination process again or any other recommendations they make. Apart from guiding the nomination and election of a new bishop of Namirembe Diocese, the committee's report will also offer guidance on future nomination of leaders in other dioceses of the church. Because there have been uh, quite a number of issues raised during nomination processes, so we hope the recommendations will go beyond uh, the Mirembe Diocese issue to guide the House of Bishops and the subsequent nomination processes. The House of Bishops had initially been forwarded two names of Canon Moses Banja, the Archdeacon of Luzira, and Reverend Abraham Muyinda, who currently serves as the vicar of Namirembe Cathedral for consideration. Right Reverend Luba Fostitol Walida's tenure as Bishop of Namirembe officially comes to an end on 8th December. Joyce Nakato, NTV Tonight.